All right, welcome back, BPD fam. It is me, Big Papa D. And I'm back for another one. I, you know, I've done an examination of my channel, and uh, everything that has been suggested for me has been very, very good. Um, the artists have been amazing. I, and I'm going to continue to do the ones that I enjoy, the ones that you fans enjoy uh but every you know every time i sit down and do a video i'm going to do a couple for me <laughs> because um the adage is to grow uh you need to keep the customers you have but also go for the ones you don't have so i'm going to expand out a little bit uh, we kind of got pigeonholed into this uh uh, singers, you know, great singers thing, which I love because, I mean, at my heart, that's <laughs> vocals and that art is like my favorite thing. So uh, we're going to expand out a little bit. Um, but today's artist really isn't expanding. <laughs> uh, this is a new artist to our channel. It's in the same realm as that, but this is a group that I've listened to probably six or seven of their songs. And so it's one for me, and it's keeping with the theme that we've, you know, uh, got on here. Uh, but to find out who that is, stay tuned. If you guys aren't already a subscriber, aren't already a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified of future videos. Comment down below. If uh, you have any requests, my... Cash app is in the description, or you can also do a super thanks and let me know what you want me to react to. Or the easiest way is to become a Patreon member. Um, I have, uh, now I have two Patreon members, so I have doubled. My Patreon is doubled. And uh, basically with Patreon, you get exclusive content. You get early access to every video. Like today, I'll record five or six videos and I'll immediately upload those on Patreon uh, so you can see them all at one time. So like you can binge watch my videos. You don't have to wait all week long to watch, you know, two a day. Uh, also uh, with the tiers you get a request. Uh, so varying requests based on what tier level you choose. So uh, I think it's all the ways. I'll oh, check out my new merch store. It's down below. And once again, um, if uh, you guys want to reach out to me um, through the comments, I'm willing, you know, I like to interact. So uh, make sure you do, do that as much as possible. <laughs> Okay, as you can see from the big giant purple lettering, the group we're doing today is Pentatonix. I've been enjoying Home Free so much that uh, I was looking to do, like I said, I heard about five or six Pentatonix songs before. So I was looking to, you know, throw a couple Pentatonix in there in between all the Home Frees I've been doing. And... Man, like my allergies are getting to me today. Okay. Almost. You ever get that, like, you got to sneeze, but it's not coming out? That's pretty much where I'm at. Um, today, it's kind of uh, two pleasures here. Number one, I like pentatonics. Number two, this song is one of my favorite songs of all time. Uh, the song we're doing today is Creep by Radiohead. It's a Radiohead cover by Pentatonix. I can only imagine what they're going to do with this. And I think this is just a lyric video. I'm not 100% sure. But without any further ado, we have Creep by Pentatonix. When you were here before, I couldn't look you in the eye. You're just like an angel Your skin makes me cry You flow like a feather In a beautiful world You 
You're so very special. I wish I was special. I'm not sure what that sound is. It sounds a little bit like a steel drum, but it's probably from a synth. Obviously, this day and age, it's probably just, <laughs> you know, a uh, loop or anything they pulled off the thing. But it's, it's interesting. It's not really uh, music, but it's adding to the beat and the intensity and the building coming. So let me back this up just a touch. In a beautiful world, you're so very special. I wish I was special. Bubble letters. But I'm a creep. I want the perfect soul. I want you to notice when I'm not around. It's so very special. So very special. I did not expect that. Those heavy guitar riffs. When you think of pentatonics, you don't think of heavy guitar riffs. That was very, very unexpected. I just want to talk about the song a little bit. This song, obviously. <laughs> Uh, it's not just me, it's song related to a lot of people. Even though in my life I've been a very, you know, Gregorious person, always uh, kind of the life of the party, I've also felt kind of extremely awkward around people my entire life. I'm just, I've had the ability to, you know, jump past this and put on this, you know, kind of persona, this... Uh, wild and crazy persona, but I've always kind of felt uncomfortable in most situations, um, to be honest. I mean, I do well. I, I sold cars for most of my life, so, and I've been in a lot of, you know, business situations, been, you know, at fancy dinners. I've been, you know, basically met a lot of celebrities and, but just like almost every situation I do socially, other than like when I do Uber, I don't feel awkward. It's because one on one or one on two or three, I don't feel awkward that in that way. But like anytime where there's a larger group, or I don't know, I've just always felt awkward. I don't know if that's just normal for all humans that feel we feel awkward. But I've always felt awkward and out of place. I just didn't show it, usually. Like, when I would go out to, like, a club or a bar, I had to get there early. I had to get wherever I was holding court <laughs> set. And then people could come to me. If I arrived at a place late, I, it was so awkward. Like, because you feel like you're cut, you're going you're you know basically crashing a party you're not invited to and then you got to kind of pick your way through the crowd find people that you know and that always felt like i said i've just always felt awkward even though i've done well to you know work around that but i've kind of always felt out of place almost everywhere i've ever been in almost every situation <laughs> That I'm in. Other than I'm one, what I'm one on one with people, or you know, in a very small group, uh, especially it don't have to. It could be strangers. It could be people I know. I, I'm pretty comfortable one on one with most people because I'm confident that number one, my conversation, uh, and just I don't know, just my spirit will bleed through and they'll get it. So, but I said larger groups. Kind of awkward. Sorry for that tirade, but it just reminded me. So this song really stuck with me. And also, like, you know, and I hate when I watch reactions and the reactor just goes on forever, but I just got to get it out because it's in my head. Also, like, 
kind of in this one, like I've always felt like, even all the Lord of the Ace ships, the girls I've been with, I'm not quite good enough. You know what I'm saying? I'm not once I get into the relationship, but at first, it's like, oh, even though I would ask girls out all the time, <laughs> I didn't have a problem with that. But I mean, the awkwardness was there. I felt it. I just, like I said, I had the awkwardness. I was just always able to just go past it. So I'm sorry for that. Let me uh, back up here. When I'm not around It's so very special I wish I was special <laughs> Wow So high Woo. I think my cats just got scared insane different arrangement talk about making something your own when you that was crazy <laughs> i don't even know what that was like Wee! i got it so freaking high i don't even know what <laughs> like i said that's like it oh, i was so high <laughs> it's weird that's weird that they just decided okay we're just gonna Go to the top of my range here <laughs> and belt that part out. Because that's way higher than the, the original. <laughs> like I said, they just completely made that their own. And it was kind of, uh, it was just interesting. And it, like to me, like the guitars were heavier than the original too. So it's just, I think that once you, they've been around for so long now that they're comfortable just being super creative with stuff. Uh, that was interesting. That was very, very, very interesting. Uh, yeah. The, 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 see, the thing is, I, I've heard uh, Mary Did You Know and a couple more of the things, and that was just straight acapella. I don't even think there was music, to be honest with you. Maybe, maybe. But it was not, like, you know, prevalent. Uh, so that's the last I've known of Pentatonics for them to. Oh, and they were on the Mass Singer too. And so whatever they did on there. But yeah, that was insane. <laughs> that was absolutely insane. Uh, guys, uh, let me know if you uh, want me to keep doing Pentatonics. Comment down below your favorite Pentatonics song. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please hit the subscribe button. Uh, all your new Pentatonics people, I'm not sure what uh, your fan, the fan, Pentatonics fan base is called. Everyone, every fan base uh, has a name now, so I'm not sure what. The, uh, I don't know the Pentamaniacs. I don't know what they, what they're called, but you can let me know down in the comments. Uh, once again, I appreciate you joining me. Uh, check out all my other avenues uh, as far as support of the channel, the Patreon, super thanks, all those other things. Uh, your support is very, very welcome, very, very appreciated. You will see me again. Peace and love.